introducing the back handspring on the beam can be scary for some athletes. So why not take the fear out and make it fun? This drill provides the athlete time to create great habits before putting the skill on the beam. In this drill, we use the Addy Beam, Booster Blocks, and a Octagon to create a station that allows the gymnast to progress at her own pace. Starting with the gymnast standing on the beam and preparing for a back handspring. She then jumps up over the octagon, concentrating on an early split and open shoulders. As she is rolling the octagon, she is pulling with her front leg to create a 180 degree split as soon as the hands contact the beam and, in this case, the booster blocks. This station allows the athlete to progress to proper hand placement as they become more confident with the jump and split, creating great habits for great beam back handsprings. This drill creates a progressional approach to the back handspring on the beam. It is an easy side station to set up and allows the gymnast to work independently on the parts of this skill without rushing it. This drill will teach an early split that will help roll the octagon over. It slows down the back handspring so proper hand placement can be worked on and perfected. Thank you for watching Tumble Track Training Tips. For more videos like these, go to our YouTube channel at youtube.com slash tumbletrack or visit our website at tumbletrack.com. Tumble Track Training Tips capture athletes who are working towards improving their skills. Please evaluate these tips for content rather than execution. Equipment is designed and manufactured in accordance with the latest product industry standards. This alone does not prevent injury. It is the responsibility of the equipment owner and user to use good judgment as well as read and follow all warning instructions. Improper use of the equipment can result in severe personal injury including paralysis or death. This equipment must only be used under the supervision of trained and qualified instructors.